Hello, and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be discussing how Airbnb's record-breaking week has added $15 billion in value as travel booms. We'll take a closer look at why Airbnb has experienced such a surge in the market, and how other travel-related industries are also seeing an upturn in business. So, let's get started. Airbnb has had its biggest weekly gain since its initial public offering in 2020, climbing 21% this week. This has added a staggering $15 billion to its market value. The company's success can be attributed to strong travel demand as people start to travel more frequently, and it has delivered its highest-ever full-year profit. The company's CEO, Brian Chesky, has also given an optimistic outlook for the beginning of 2023. According to Chesky, travel bookings are showing a recovery to pre-pandemic levels, which has sparked a surge in optimism. At least 25 analysts have raised their 12-month price target on the stock since its February 14 earnings report, which has also contributed to the increase in value. The resurgence in travel has not just boosted Airbnb, but also other travel-related industries. Hotel giant Marriott International Inc. has reported strong earnings, and its shares have reached their highest level since April. Other companies, like Uber and traditional hotel chains like Hilton, are also experiencing a rise in revenue. Although some travel-related stocks in the US, including Airbnb, have declined on Friday, many investors are still optimistic about the industry's growth potential. A recent recovery in bookings for cruise lines has seen an increase in stock prices for companies like Carnival Corporation and Norwegian Cruise Line Holdings Limited, both of which have seen an increase of at least 40% so far this year. Online travel booking service TripAdvisor Inc. has also reported better-than-expected quarterly results this week, and Air France KLM has closed 5.3% higher on Friday after reporting record quarterly revenue. The upturn in travel demand is also good news for airline stocks as several carriers are forecasting strong demand for the year despite inflation and an impending recession. The S&P Super Composite Airlines Industry Index has risen by 18% this year. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos like this.